Hi there, my name is Ethan. And I'm Taylor. We're representing Colorado Springs in the 2019 Conrad Spirit of Innovation Challenge. Amidst all of the vested interests debating the future of climate change regulations, we as high schoolers decided we wanted to make a difference. Colorado's drying soil and arid climate conditions reap dangerous consequences for local plant and wildlife, leading to nearly 3.4 million acres of insect-induced deforestation in our state. Uncovering the source of this natural disaster led us to the elusive pine beetle species, an insect that burrows into tree bark and slowly but deliberately kills surrounding ecosystems. After learning more about the pine beetle, we decided to research and develop our own solution, a responsive mobile app called PineSight, which equips park rangers with the tools to diagnose outbreaks in real time. To prevent deforestation, park services usually invest funds into one of two pipelines, ground-based and aerial monitoring. After aerial technology detects the general area of an outbreak, then park rangers perform a ground-based diagnosis to gain further insight into its spread. However, current ground techniques incur high time and operational costs, leaving underfunded stations with no way to contain the spread of an infestation. As opposed to relying on their mere intuition to gauge the relative size and coloration of spots, our app will enable rangers to generate more detailed statistics in just one or two clicks, saving them time and money. Simply boot up the Pineside app, which runs off iOS or Android, and click on the camera icon to begin scanning. Hold the cell phone up to the tree bark and match the scanner up to the fitted tree outline. Scan a photo of the infected bark and enter additional user input to inform the accuracy of the report. The app then proceeds to generate a comprehensive infestation report using machine learning technology. Convolutional deep neural networks analyze nuances in visual imagery to estimate several key indicators in photographs. In our case, the tree's estimated life expectancy and infestation radius. To train the algorithm, we will simply use public open source data sets released by the USDA and build the cloud-based network off of Google's TensorFlow framework. Full products developed pine beetle analysis are not only expensive, but also require bulky hardware and accessible to stations with limited resources. Sometimes an outbreak is hundreds of miles from the nearest station, and an app running on cell phones will provide an unprecedented level of mobility. We will use your generous support to offset time delays with manual sampling, pay for rights to use higher grade data, and train slash test the cognition of our neural network. When we're ready to take in revenue, we will offer licensing to individual rangers and eventually scale our product for partnerships with local and statewide forest ranging services. We're hoping you'll join us on our mission to empower park rangers to face real environmental challenges. Thank you for your time.